I have really relied on my RV campsite setup checklist. It's really been a lifesaver for me. I'll preview your campsite before you back in, check. So now I need to level the trailer from side to side. Yep, my bubble's way over there. I'm not level side to side. So I'm gonna have to bring this side up. Okay, let's check the level bubble again. Oh shoot, I'm not even close to being level. I feel like I'm putting together a jigsaw puzzle. Oh my gosh, I don't know if this is gonna be high enough. Ah. See, it's still not level. Oh, I can't get it level side to side. It didn't look that uneven when I pulled in, but it really is. I really don't want to do this, but I think I'm going to have to get back in my truck and move my camper over this way a little bit more so the ground isn't so uneven. All right, I'm gonna move forward and then back up again so that I can get this trailer leveled from side to side. I'm gonna go see what's going on back there. Yeah, I'm considerably further over, so that should make a big difference. I'm pretty close to those trees, but if I come straight back, I should be good. I hope I can get it level now. I moved over. That's several feet from where I was before. Let's check and see how level it is side to side now. Yeah, it's still not level. Oh, once I put those blocks underneath again, I'm really hoping that it will be level. can see my tire is half on and half off. <laughs> Shoot, I'm tempted to edit that out, but this is the real deal and I've got to try this again. Okay, the tire is in the center of the blocks. Bingo! Now, let's go check the level. Oh, please, oh, please, oh, please, be even. Oh, side to side. I mean, we're not perfect, but I'm gonna take it. Woohoo, we did it! Okay, I never expected that getting level was gonna be so difficult. This was challenging. Don't let this intimidate you. Most sites are more level than this one is. Okay, the next thing on my checklist is to chalk the wheels.
Okay, the next thing on the list is to place a block under the jack. I already did that. And remove weight distribution bars. Lower the jack to take pressure off the hitch. Okay. Now I need to disconnect the chains, the seven-way power cord, and the breakaway cable. Then I need to remove the ball coupler safety pin, then lift the ball coupler off the ball hitch, and then I need to raise the tongue jack until the coupler releases from the ball. Oh, I'm making so much progress. And the next thing I need to do is level my trailer from front to back. I can see my bubbles way over there, so I'm not level. I've got to lower the tongue jack. Bingo! We're level front to back. Come on, Fancy. Yes, check out camp. It's officially set up. <laughs> Finally. Pretty nice campsite. Having an RV campsite setup checklist has been a lifesaver for me as an RV campsite setup newbie. It really just takes the stress away because I know exactly what to do. Because when I'm at my campsite and unhitching, it's intimidating. You know, and if people are watching you, I even get more stressed. But I just take my time and I follow the checklist. You can download your free copy on my website and that's gonna be found right here. And I'll also leave a link to it in the video description below. It's free and you can go ahead and print up your own copy. If you're an RV newbie or you just want to have confidence tearing down your campsite, watch this video right up here next. I'm going to show you that I can do it and if I can do it, you can do it too. And I've also got a tear down checklist for you as well when you watch this video right up here. So I can't wait to see you over in this video next.